How many times do you think we're gonna have to hit this thing to try and get Maddie to let us in here? Double cheeseburger, no ketchup. Oh no! <laughs> What happened to your head the other day? <laughs> oh. oh my god. Look at it. Your nails. That's what happens when you go into corners, buddy. I'm not a big corners guy, yeah, I don't know. We know. Can you fold this? This is, his third, this is his third time trying to fold this. <laughs> okay, wait, try one more time. <laughs> we had a blast. At the uh, down at Rusty Buffalo for the second annual Potathon. Yeah. Thank you again, B and G Charities, for having us out. Ron, you're the man. It was a blast hanging with Nate Geary, Trainwreck, all those guys as always. The big news is we're dropping the spring line on May. <laughs> so you're just gonna sit there, or are you gonna tell us your story? Hmm? You gonna sit there and tell us your story? Okay, I'm gonna tell you my story. So basically, I'm in a really sticky situation. So today was just like any normal day. I brushed my jibs, took a shower, checked myself out a little bit, and I went downstairs to discover something pretty crazy. What do you mean by crazy? Crazy. I noticed there was a package. What could it be? I don't know. I didn't know whether to unbox it now or to unbox it later. In a situation like this, you never know what it could be. It could be, it could be an explosive device. It could be a wild animal. It could, be a, it could be a gift card from my Aunt Salamander. It has been 43 days since this package arrived at my doorstep. I, I haven't eaten, barely. I, I barely drink, and yet I'm still running out of resources. Now, do I open it? Everyone I know has told me to open it. But, I like to go against the grain. This time, I think I'm gonna let it slide. I think I'm gonna open it. So guys, I'm just now realizing that uh, this package is from my boys over at Just Dishin. Um, so these past 43 days of me torturing myself has not been worth it. So that's that's good. Now, if you're new here, I don't want to scare you off. Welcome to the world of Just Dishin, where 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 every everything is is just is just is just Dishin. I don't want to talk too much and take up any more of your time. So let's see what's inside. Guys, the first product. Look at this. Holy my god, it is warm. You guys don't know how warm this is gonna keep me. There, there is four inches of snow outside at the end of March, beginning of April. This, you guys should feel this inside. Just dishing down the sleeve. You got the J JDH Just Dishin logo right here. You got the I don't know what's inside. I don't know what kind of animal they they killed and put inside. We also got, can you guys, wow, Phil. It's like the KFC. These guys are young geniuses. Do I look good, do I look good in this hat? Hold on. Do I look good right now? This might be my new personal favorite. I, you know, I love the sweatshirt. Look at these joggers. Are you guys looking at these right now? Look at the stripe down my leg. 
As you can see, we got the Justition logo on the pants right here. We got the red and white trim down the side, and you got the cuffs at the bottom, which make it very comfortable around your ankle. So guys, here's another little close up of what the boys over at Justition sent me. You got the Justition sweatshirt with the beautiful design down the sleeve. You got the Phil Kessel hat. KFC style. You really can never go wrong with a Phil Kessel design on your clothing. And last but definitely not least, the joggers with the red and white trim down the side. Extremely comfortable for all environments, honestly. I'm gonna be wearing these almost every day. All right guys, if you're a hockey player, a hockey fan, a hockey coach, a hockey, a hockey scoreboard, scoreboard guy you guys will love this clothing you will love everything about this company this clothing is top quality very comfortable for all sizes and all genders so thank you so much to the boys at justition for the package and uh lose for hughes <laughs> carter woolly reporting um really nice weather out nice day today um it's not cold man like People, people are like freaking out because of how cold it is. Um, I can't even tell because of how comfortable my pants are. So, um, can we go back inside now? <laughs>